Hello everybody, AquaGear here and welcome back to another episode of Aqua's Adventure. Today we are back on my single player world and we're going to be doing a big project today. We're going to be starting on the Nether War farm thing. So it's going to be a fairly big project, we're going to get started on it today. We're definitely not going to get done, but I'll see you guys with uh, the first couple parts. Alright everybody, let's get started with the building. So as you know, last episode we collected these materials, which is a lot of material. Let's grab some of the things we might use, like some of the stone, some of the soul sand. I don't think we'll be using the glass. Let's grab some dispensers. One thing we didn't make is actually the hoppers. That's Oh, that's actually one thing I forgot. I mean, we're not going to need a lot of hoppers because um, this we only need like maybe like 10 hoppers max. Let's see if we even actually have some chests. Okay, yeah, we do have a couple chests, but we'll resolve that in a little bit. Of course, we're not going to get too far today. I'm thinking maybe build, like, the first two layers, maybe. I just want to kind of get the feel of it. And, guys, we're going to be building this right over here. So, in this space right here. Since the build is about 15 by 17 or something like that, I think this space will be big enough. So first, we're going to get started with actually placing the soul sand. So, in my redstone uh, testing world, or building world, whatever you want to call it, uh, I put uh, soul sand. I'm, I just, it needs to be a block up, so I'm just going to do that. There's uh, 10 rows, and so it's 10 by 8. So, this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And we need to go 8 back. So, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And then of course, we need to fill this all in like this. And we're going to be collecting all the things from that corner over there. So the hoppers will go around right there. But let's place all the soul sand real quickly. So let's place all these in. And I'm, I'm like hoping that we'll have enough soul sand to finish this project. But I'm, I honestly think we do. Sorry about that. So the hoppers will go right here. Just kind of building blocks. I have no idea why I elevated, elevated it one up here. I think it's, be, it's because I do want to put the hoppers uh, along this row right here so again we'll get the hoppers later and really now what we need to do let me actually make some stone so it doesn't uh, go back into cobble each layer is two up so the next layer should be right here let's actually do these layers a little bit like this and one two three another layer sh will be right here one, two, three. Another layer will be right here. And then one, two, three. Another layer will be right here. Well, guys, there's our five layers of soul sand. So each one is going to have uh, another word on them, and it'll drop down to here. By the way, guys, if you keep seeing that I keep cutting, it's because I'm trying to test a little bit. Because I've been playing around in my audio settings. Uh, so there, there again, like I said, there's those five layers, and now I'm going to build up the walls of stone on the sides. Should have brought more stone with me, this was not smart of me. Yeah, each, each side is going to have big walls of stone. And I'm thinking what we'll do this episode, as I've kind of made my mind, is we'll probably do a lot of the building this episode, and we'll do the redstone uh, in later episodes. Yeah, when we when we head back to the house, we'll grab practically all of all the rest of the supplies, and we'll do that. So I'm just gonna kind of finish this wall up here, and then we'll go get the rest of the stuff. Back here are where the dispenser is gonna go, and then the chests are eventually gonna go around right there. So that's technically the beginning of the build. So let's head back to the base. Let me eat something before I die. Actually, no. I put out these cakes for a reason. Let me eat some of these cakes. Do that. Like a so. Do that. Right, that'll make us 16 hoppers. That That's more than enough. I'm going to laugh at myself when I already have hoppers. Enough of them. But... Actually, no, I don't. Okay, yeah. I, I don't have any. They would have been in there. So it'll go down this path right here. And I guess we'll... The chest, yeah, the chest room will be somewhere around here. I'm just gonna kind of clear out a space. 
let's see. I'm just going to do that for now and lead the hoppers into there. That's where um, all of the items will drop because there will be dispensers back there with water inside of them. And if you guys do want to see the design, go check out the last episode of Aqua's Adventure because they will be there. And of course, chest will go right here. I'm just substituting that right now so I could get that in place. All oh, whoops. All right, we're going to, well, yeah, this wall needs to go away right here. Let's start building up on here, and with that, we'll also be able to take away this wall because glass is going to go right there. Or not glass, open air. Uh, the block next to that glass will have to go there, which I will show you guys in a little bit after I clean the small portion up right there. So, yeah, I'm going to do this because if I keep building and building and these layers aren't done, it's just going to be harder and harder. And I'll be able to regenerate life while I build so I don't fall to my death, which will be smart. Okay, well, I did put some stone in the furnaces, so we'll be able to get more of this stone that we need. But, uh, since the stone is cooking, we'll have to do something else for now, and I'm thinking we'll do the glass part. And, if you haven't noticed yet, I did finish these layers, so they're all filled in. The glass will have to go, I think, right here. In my redstone building world, I made this pillar out of glass. <laughs> I'll say out of grass. Out of grass? What? <laughs> uh, I made this out of... Gr I was about to say grass again. What's wrong with me? Glass. But I don't think I'm going to do that because I already built this. So I'm just going to leave this first layer as... Not grass. <laughs> glass. Whoopsies. And we have so much glass to go around. I think I I'm not going to... I'm not going to worry about if we lose one piece. And then we'll put the dispensers in the back. And then I think we'll finish off the stone. And next episode we'll do the redstone and possibly the chest room i think we might do the chest room this episode it depends how long i feel like this episode should be i'm gonna cover this up like this and if we do decide to expand this sometime that'll be easy to do so i'm not gonna worry about that we can actually if we have enough stone let's actually finish off the roof right over here and then we'll put we'll start putting in the dispensers if i have enough uh though now that i do the math in my head i'm i feel quite uh, not smart because I just realized if each thing has 10, 10 rows, then we'll need 50 dispensers. I only have 31 on me at the moment. So we will have to go make some things. This is another wart farm in my redstone testing world. So as you can see, for, the, for those of you that haven't watched my previous episode, this is the redstone in the back, which I probably will improve maybe. This is where you get in. But, yeah, this is what it's going to look like at its final product. This is the little chest room, but I will fix this chest room, obviously, because that looks horrible. But the thing I wanted to look at is really the dispensers right here. So that's where the water is going to come from. And I'll even show you guys real quick, just quickly, and then we'll get back to actually building. Press this button. All the water comes out of the dispensers, comes up all the way to the edge, drops another one in there. And then you s press the button again, and it stops. The only bad thing is you do have to go back in there and replant the nether war, but I don't think there's any way to go around that. But yeah, let's get back to the world. Well, let's go in the back over here and start adding the dispensers, which are here. But, of course, we need more dispensers and we need uh, a lot more stone to get this done. So let's run back inside and let's start crafting and grabbing and hopefully we'll actually get 30 levels so we can enchant something. Let's see how much of this is done. So let's grab what we can. I see most of the stone, stone is like half cooked, so, whoopsies, <laughs> nope, I need that. Let's just grab what we can, this will tie this over until the next time we come back, alright. So there's, those are the dispensers, let's grab the string we have here. Okay, and we gotta go get some sticks to make the arrows, where's some sticks? The dispenser, yes it is. So we just gotta keep doing this. Oh, I, just, I almost made a dropper. Oh, so I have to do it like that? Alright. Okay, uh, so I guess we'll just do that and then press shift. That makes sense. Shift. That shift. So the water can flow down through here. Let's take the dispensers. And of course, we walk slow on Soul Sand. So this is going to be a little bit of a drag. But that's how it'll go. So we do that. I, I guess we'll keep doing this while we go up. So then from here, I'm going to have to go up twice to get to the next level of dispensers. And I'm going to have to hold shift. Alright, that's fine. 
yeah, so I honestly think we'll have more than enough materials. We'll probably have more, probably have materials left over after this. I think this is last row. Yeah, it is. This is our last row of dispensers, and we, of course, we do have two left over. Like I predicted, let's try to get over here without falling so we could just do this part right here. Oh, okay, well, we'll fall down and just do this real quickly. First, let's make some fence gates. How do we make the fence gates? Do we make them like this? Birch fence gate. I guess we'll make them birch. Um, I'm not really too worried about it. I guess we'll... Oh, no. Oh, okay, no. Six. Six, that's fine. Let's... Let's make, like, one more just, just in case. And with these, we'll just finish up and make some ladders. Like a so. Let's do this. And we'll also collect the rest... Ugh, the rest of the stone inside the chest not chest furnaces so many mistakes today I can't even believe it and we'll just do it the quick way and do it like this and we'll place the chests back let's do that yeah, it's really the quick way of collecting it of course I don't get an XP which was quite stupid of me but I'm not gonna worry too much about it I can I can get XP from killing killing mobs and stuff like this and let's finish up this brick but of course I will leave that open right there just so we know that's where the fence gates will go let's just do this okay we've hit a wall let's go right over here actually no let's just jump down oh that was so close to death right there that was really close let's ease something maybe we can regenerate while building how it went I think we have the ladder on this side like this let's go all the way up 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 and I will go all the way up so maybe I can get on the roof and I will have to place torches on the roof because of mobs but I will do that in a in in a little bit I think we'll go two out for each one like this uh, two out for each one and then we'll place the fence gates okay two out like that is that two out yep So let's get our fence gates out and start at the bottom. Over here, and w the cool thing is the water can't like go out of here because of the fence gate. That's another reason why I just love these fence gates at the moment. Okay, so let's do that. I think this is the last one, yep. So it's looking good so far. And now, of course, we have a way to get down so we don't die every time. And let's go get some torches. Torches are really important. That's one thing I, I also neglected in my redstone testing world. Because in my redstone... Bleh, <laughs> I've been trying to talk way too fast. In my redstone testing world, uh, I have a tendency of not using torches and forgetting about survival that um, mobs will spawn. I have a tendency to do that by accident. But of course, we got lucky with this design that we can place torches without a problem. All right, so really all we have all we have to do left is the redstone inside. We'll do this little chest room later on. We will have to fill up each dispenser with the water buckets, but of course we will do that or I will do that off camera. But honestly, I think we've done en enough work for today. Uh, the actual build is done. Again, just the redstone and the chest. Let's actually check up and I will have to end the episode right now, guys, really, really soon, but let's just check up on them. I really haven't traded anything lately, so I don't really have anything to show you. I do want to catch another horse, and I do need two saddles, but again, that'll happen later. Let's check how much chicken we have. I haven't been on this world too much, but okay, th that's good. Why is there eggs? Okay, that's not any good, but two stacks of chicken for being online not very long. Okay, uh, I'll take it. Let's just throw the eggs up top. Let's feed our chickens like that. Okay, so we got another chicken in there. That's fun. Jump, a little bit of parkour. Yep, our egg machine is still going, our little oasis. One thing we still haven't done is I still haven't filled up the pool with water. I know I said I'd do that, and I never did. I'm just kind of too lazy about it. Yeah, I think I could have built this better. I was very um, limited on material back then, but I think for what I had, it looks very good for what I had again. Yeah, this is a little pool. We never ended up actually filling it with water, but I will do that and we will jump amazingly. 
So yeah, guys, let's head back. Kind of just put our material in the chest, and then we're going to have to say our goodbyes. Sadly, yep. Let's run over here. I still don't like this building. This building looks ugly. That roof doesn't make any sense. But the actual building is very useful, so. But uh, one day I might come back to this and finish off the roof. Or rebuild the roof, who knows. But again, that'll be for... What? I just went through the door. <laughs> Epic. Let's just stick everything in here. Other than our food and our picks. Oh, bam. And I guess I'll keep the torches. Now let me take my stuff off. Let's go outside for the outro. You know what? Let's do it with old pumpkin head because he's such a nice dude well guys this is going to have to be the end of this episode i hope you guys enjoyed of course i enjoyed playing this has been aqua gear make sure to leave a like and a comment as it supports my channel and i'll, and I'll see you guys later god bless and goodbye